Even though he was just a small boy, Keldon Eichberg had a big effect on all those around him. In this week's Community Spotlight, we show you how the impact of a little boy has brought a community together. In the small, peaceful town of Laporte, a common sound in the summer is the sound of crickets. But Sunday afternoon, that sound was replaced by the roar and rumbling of motorcycles. This ride began because of a special little boy who at the age of five was diagnosed with brain cancer. After two years of keeping a smile on his face, Calden ended his fight. He had, I want to say, five or seven brain surgeries. Um, just always a smile on his face, battled through everything. The toughest little boy ever. But our story doesn't end there. Calden inspired a community to come together and his uncle, who never imagined of stepping up and putting together events like this ride titled Keldon's Legacy. When Keldon was diagnosed, I, I knew I wanted to do something, so that's when I started the first one. And I've, I guess I've surprised a lot of people <laughs> with as much as I've pulled the, together and made things happen because I was never known as that person. In the eyes of his family and relatives, Keldon continues to live on through the kindness of giving and community spirit. Proceeds raised from Keldon's Legacy Ride will continue Keldon's kindness by helping out families that are going through similar struggles. The money that we raise is going to go to um, either a family in need that is in the same situation that Keldon and his family was in or, and or partially um, to brain cancer awareness. One thing is certain, Keldon at such a young age was able to accomplish so much uniting a community and bringing them together. He, he always had a smile and he always wanted to help anybody he could and that's kind of the way with doing the legacies. Even though he's not with us, he's still with us and still given. Even after the thunder of the motorcycles fade, the calm of the crickets will echo Keldon's legacy. All right, and if you would like to contribute to Keldon's, Keldon's legacy, you can do so at Bemidji's First National Bank. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.